can stop Plankton's rampage of destruction. Do you want to drive a really cool tank? Hi, everybody. Welcome to Atlantis Square Pantis. We start things off, as all the best stories do, with an ice cream tank rampage. Guide Plankton in this tank that he, uh, borrowed through Atlantis, starting in the armory and then escaping into the gardens. You'll need to steer the tank and fire the ice cream cannon to splat the Atlantean defenses and destroy the buildings in your way. Is Plankton finally going to get his wish for world domination? Will he use the tank to get the Krabby Patty recipe? And will the Atlantean gardeners forgive him for getting tank tracks all over the grass? Let's find out! Commander Plankton, reporting for destruction duty! <laughs>
will be mine, oh yes. Lighten Palace, my new digs. SpongeBob, I'm scared! How did we get into this mess? SpongeBob? Oh, it's easy. I got this new high-tech bubble soap. SpongeBob? Oh, no, 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 Patrick. This bubble's gonna break all records. <gasps> Well, I hope it doesn't break until we get a little closer to the ground. Huh? What have I done? Ah! 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 Hi, gang! In this level, Patrick and I explore the caves under Bikini Bottom. In this level, you can make Patrick and I run around, and you can switch between us at any time. I can use Spat, by trusty spatula, to flip open doors and flip cannons, or to move blocks out of the way. Patrick can use his strength to pick me up and throw me across the level, and he can throw anchors around too. Hey! A bubble has carried us to a strange and also wondrous cave! Cave? Oh, uh, I was hoping the bubble would carry us to a sandwich shop. Hmm, a seemingly bottomless chasm. Looks like I'll need my trusty pal Patrick's extreme strength to get across. 
Huh? Right. Throw me across the gap, and I'll be able to pull you across after me with this rope. This throwing is making... Okay, SpongeBob. Hey, it's a good thing that we brought Mr. Ropey along today. Hey, thank goodness we didn't bring Mr. Let Waiting along instead. These caves need to be explored! Whoa! I better be careful I don't fall off the edge of though. Uh-oh. Ghostly pirates! Ooh, ghostly pirates! Or are they piratey ghosts? A little bit of Sandy's oh. Karate! Sure would come in handy right about now! Or Squidward's clarinet player. Spongebob go? I better find him. What's this big cannon shaped thing? Patrick reporting! Oh. I wonder who left all these cannons here? Oh. Hey buddy! Wait there and I'll come to you! I can't wait! It seems wobbly. Oops. Hey, SpongeBob! It looks like I'm stuck, so you'll need to come and find me. This cannon's facing the wrong way. If I stand in front of it, then a quick hunt with a spatula should fix that. Spongebob what to do. This can't be good. You know, I think I can use my spatula to flip this cannon over the other way. My brain needed a rest anyway. Hello? Hello? 
could be I'm freakishly strong. I wonder what strange and wondrous treasures we'll find in these caves. Well, you're right. And maybe we'll find lunch or dinner. I can flip these things out of the way just like I flipped the portcullis. You know, exploring pirate-filled caves wasn't really on my list of things to do today. It was number two on mine, right after getting trapped in a huge, floaty bubble. Just call me SpongeBob Flippants. There we go. My years of fry cook training come in handy yet again. Huh? Someone catch you! Fly! Be free! Time for a little nap. Consider it flip. Only Count Fipula could flip better than that. I never knew there was a huge labyrinth of pirate-filled caves under Bikini Bottom! Yeah, I know. Oh, that's so weird. Uh... What's a lab... Woo! This cannon will take me back the way I came from! Your turn, Patrick! Time for a little nap. Reporting. You, Mr. Cannon, are flipped! Woo you can do it, Patrick! Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't wait! Wow!
SpongeBob? Oh, we got separated again. Looks like I'll have to go on my own. Hmm. Oh, SpongeBob isn't here for me to throw across. Maybe I could throw that anchor instead. What? Good thing I'm freakishly strong. No good. If only there was something over there to throw this anchor onto. Your turn, SpongeBob. Oh look, another thingy I can flip with my spatula. You know what would really liven this place up? Some nice rugs. Or maybe some potted plants. Oh, and lava lamps! Huh? Flying, Beefy! Wonder what they were mining down here. Maybe it was Kikorium! Wonder how far down these caverns go. Maybe it's the center of the earth. That's not very realistic. Ooh, a ghostly pirate! What this place needs is a free or two! Hey! Rickety wooden floors! Charming! I just love these things. These ghostly pirates aren't very subtle. I can see right through them. Rope ladder! But where's the exit hole, hmm? Looks like I'll have to call my trusty sidekick, Patrick! Ooh. Look out below! And or ahead! Floors look a bit rickety. Squidward would not approve. Hey look! Another anchor! They're everywhere down here! This is the lair of the Dread Pirate Anchor Beard! Mine guards are great! But I'd love to ride around in one of those. Oh! It's heavier than bubble bass! Someone catch it! No, no, wait, hang on. Doesn't look like the caves go down much further. Uh, this must be the lowest level. We're nearly at the end of our journey. Onward! What's this thing? I guess I better hold on to it. What this place needs is a fridge or two. Time to go. SpongeBob is ready. Being a pirate is great. We only count. Could flip better than that. That looks valuable. Maybe we should take it along. Huh? 
Good thing I'm freakishly strong. Good thing I'm freakishly strong. Patrick and I have escaped the spooky caves with that mysterious amulet. We've taken it to the Bikini Bottom Museum to see if any of the brainy people there know what it is. But before all that, this is a chance for me to try out my brand new camera by photographing all the cool things in the museum. 
I need to take pictures of the glowing objects in each area to score points. The better the picture I take, the more points I get. There are also secret things to photograph for bonus points. Ooh, secrety. Also, I can throw stale Krabby Patties around if I need to. They can be used to move tourists out of the way, or to stop the museum guards from yelling at me.
to refuel and sleeping! found the missing half of the Atlantean amulet? What's an Atlantean amulet? Legend says that when the two halves are joined, the path to Atlantis is opened. Yeah. 
Okay, gang, after all that excitement in the museum, it's time for a relaxing musical interlude. Wait for the notes to get to the right spot first. Don't hit them too soon. If you make too many mistakes or don't hit the notes, then the bus will run out of fuel before we reach Atlantis. After each one of us takes a turn, you'll be given a score by Mr. Krabs, who has kindly volunteered to act as judge. But he gets to keep any coins that fall down in back of the seats. Buzz, 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 buzz! Whoa, this is so amazing that I'm, 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 I'm totally amazed! Atlantis, I salute you in song! Tasty! Dig on! Dig on! I'm singing! Tasty! I'm singing! Icky! <laughs> Listen. Jump, jump, jump. Do, re, 
ray me. Do ray me. This is hard. Listen. Genius. Manita. Contribution to song. My turn, my turn, my turn. I'm Patrick, and well, I don't know what to say. This level is all about the magical flying bus. Well, it was a magical flying bus, but now that we've crashed it into the gardens, it's more of a magical hopping bus, or maybe a magical smoking, spluttering, occasionally going bus. That's why we need to find and collect all the parts that fell off in the crash. Hopefully no one will notice that we've wrecked the lawn. Anyway, a few garden gnomes or a nice shrubbery and it'll be as good as new. Each part that we find will help repair the bus so it will regain some of its old powers. But they're scattered all over the garden, so we're gonna have to go exploring. Tool kit those repairs. That tool kit's ours. Tool kit. Now we're cruising. Okay. He's engaging for that to help you. We have changed the thing. The watery spurty thing just came on. Buses are meant to fly. If we go any faster, we'll meet ourselves coming the other way! Time countdown, freezing. Oh, toolkit acquired! We'd better hop! Everyone look for a button to drive over! Watch out for that varmint! Nice toolkit. We need to get off. Oh yeah. Toolkit those repairs. Got it. Oh, I think somebody's after us. Raise up. Toolkit. 
Please hold on tight. What happened? So Atlantis is kind of a shopping mall, right? What's that thingy there? I think we're in trouble. Toolkit! The tool is ours. The tool is ours. Toolkit goes repairs. It's like time stopped or something! Long to return to you. Please tell me that's not a weapon! Go, guys! We have changed the pickle. Toolkit! I got the toolkit! It's a bump! Nice green house! I wonder if they have a yellow house. you know. Welcome. The King of Atlantis! In this level, there are three of us following the Lord Royal Highness. He's the leader of the Atlanteans, you know. Anyway, he's giving us a tour of the palace, but for some unspecified and probably completely ridiculous reason, there are hazards and traps everywhere. You have to help us avoid the hazards and pitfalls so we can finish the tour. As soon as you see a hazard on screen, you can go for it. Don't wait around. Do it as fast as you can. Keep at least one of us going all the way to the end of the section so we can see the sights and win. 
and there are five sections in total to complete. Welcome to Atlantis, my strange little friends. This garden is amazing. It's like a photosynthetic wonderland. Follow me, there is much to see. This must be Atlantis Gargantis. Are any of these plants edible? Understated. the biggest number I know. Oh, it's you guys. When do we get to see some Atlantean art? Hey, where's Mr. Krabs going? Looks like he found the treasure room. We won't see him for a while, or hopefully ever again. This place is like a Mr. Krabs magnet. Wow! It's almost like Atlantis is some kind of secret underwater city! Hello, strange tourist people! Thank 
pose to myself. So we can exchange this gold for food, right? I wonder, do we get to take a gem home as a free gift? Disappear like that. You two are a real piece of work. This way to the art room, gentlemen. Oh, at last, some culture. See you, losers. Hey there, boys. What you doing? Sandy, we're on the king's tour. Great, a royal tour. Does this mean I can be her royal squirrelness, Sandy Cheeks the First? Onwards, my strange little visitors. It's almost as good as the Squirrel Museum does. The painting is looking at me! And now, here is the science room. Yee-haw! I'll see you later, boys. Huh, it'll take more than a few fancy machines to distract me from this incredible tour. Hey, Patrick! There's a machine that makes ice cream in here. Well, goodbye, then! Suddenly, I feel very alone. The only thing that's very alone is your one brain cell. Squidward, you came back for me.
These Atlanteans are crazy! This place reminds me of Sandy's house. Skull, though the idea is appealing. Good luck with the bubbles, man, Bob. We've had enough of this tour. Howdy! Ooh, is this the bubbles now? Is it? That's right, Patrick. At the end of this corridor lie our dreams. The world's oddest bubble! Old is not oddest. Oh, well now I'm disappointed. Bubbly. The 
must guess the password to prove you are worthy of seeing the oldest bubble ever. Mr. Krabs has found the Atlantean treasure room, and the Lord Royal Highness has told him he can take as much as he likes. Naturally, Mr. Krabs doesn't want to insult the Atlanteans by refusing their generosity, so he's decided to take some treasure home. While Mr. Krabs is busy swimming around in all the treasure, Sandy is going to help him collect it with her brand new invention, the Bubble Collector 2000. I don't know why she doesn't use a net, but anyway, you need to help Sandy by pointing the bubble at the treasure and then grabbing it to score points. Can you get enough points before time runs out? Bubble Collector 2000 ready? Check! This place needs some country and western music to liven things up. Oh, <laughs> 
Isn't Squidward a nice guy? Now that we've found the Atlantean Hall of Art, he's given the artist the honor of painting him as he poses. He said something about finally meeting some people with class. I don't know what he means by that. Patrick and I have plenty of class, right, Patrick? Patrick, get your head out of there. You don't know where it's been. You must help Squidward strike the correct pose for the artists. Do them as quickly as you can, but don't make any mistakes. Life drawing class is open. William should see me now. Inspiring. SpongeBob isn't here to annoy me. You flatter me. Breathtaking. I can do this all day. Party. Great brush strokes. This is easier than I thought. Unprecedented.
Now it's Patrick's turn to get behind the camera. We need some souvenir photographs of our time in Atlantis to show the people back home. Look for the glowing objects and be sure to photograph them. It's always worth taking a picture of anything else that looks interesting, too. You never know what secrets there are in the museum. Keep an eye out for the Atlantean guards, though. They don't like people using flash photography for some reason. Hey, I could use the photos to make a slideshow of my trip to Atlantis and take it to boating school. Mrs. Puff loves my impromptu slide presentations. They always bring tears of joy to her eyes. A visit to our museum is a journey inside history. That instrument is all stringy. Puppet clams, I'm good! I didn't know sirens had maracas. I'm a natural with this. I better restock on patties. Oh, great! Photo time! Siren Karaoke! Well, that was good! More patties! More patties! I better get some more patties! Time for Happy Snappy! I'm out of patty ammo! Well, that was good! Forsooth, would appear I am utterly spent in ye patty department. Uh-oh, out of patty. That instrument is all strange. Patties, where are you? Ocean, uh, ocean, uh, uh, ocean, uh, ocean, clams, I'm good, yeah, I'm a natural at this, I was born to photograph, uh. well, shake my tambourine, will you look at that, great photographs, Patrick, Look at that! Nice! I can't wait to photograph that really old bubble. Make the coffee. 
Great photo. I will ask you a question. You must hit the correct answer with a patty. If the planet Mars turns purple, then who is a squirrel? Sandy. Correct. Do not interfere with the brain of Atlantis. Pardon me, but... Wow! I'm played out of patties. I better restock on patties. I'm out of patty ammo. Don't forget to visit our bubble displays. Single file, everyone! Single file! Electric Star! Photographer! The Gun Rhymes! I'm out of patty ammo! More patties! More patties! Can I get through here? You guys get a move on! Hear me, little pink star. I will question. You must answer by tossing a patty at one of the three choices. If one and one equals three and C bream are toothless, then who has only one eye? Plankton. Affirmative. The museum is open. Be sure to visit the world's oldest living bubble. Patties, where are you? Can I get through here? SpongeBob's gonna love that one. Now this is the most bubbly museum I've ever seen. No more baddies! A visit to our museum is a journey inside history. Great photo. I feel so alive! Uh-oh, out of patties. I will ask you a question. You must hit the correct answer with a patty. If it takes three fish nine days to dig a hole, then who was a sailor in the Navy? Grabs! You are wise. I could be some kind of a famous photographer! Fish. Welcome to the Knowledge Machine. Ask any question you dare. Hello, I can answer any question you may have. I'm going to... This museum is set up with kind contributions to the of the map. An invasion force is more honest. Only if you start flossing. Excuse me. Can I get through here? Well, that was good. Wow, you got some knowledgeable photographs there. The museum is always open. Yeah! I could be some kind of a famous photographer! Fish. The museum is open. Be sure to visit the world's oldest living bubble. These Atlanteans sure are weird. In a good way. Can I get a ticket to the moon? I don't want to pose it, but that is pretty darn fabulous. Oh, Papa Clams, I'm good. Time for Happy Snappy. Well, crimp my ossicles. I'm out of patty. I'm out of patty ammo. 
That's one for the album. Daddies, where are you? Well, grip my Please do not play tennis with the bubble exhibits. I'm a natural with this. Well, grip my ossicles. I'm out of patties. I could be some kind of a famous photographer. Fish. The museum is free to tourists. Please come in. Are these life size? I must be huge! <laughs> Can I get a ticket to the moon? Time for happy snapping! Great! Ooh. Oh no! I'm out of fatty ammo! More patties! More patties! Great space age photography there, Patrick! Let me at him! Time for happy snapping! It stinks. I was born to photograph! Ugh. Lighten up! Nice. I bet I can pick it up. Hey! Single file, everyone! Single file! A titanium bomb aligned with a tungsten, strontium, and thallium shell, if I'm not mistaken. Sticky sticky. Can I get through here? I've seen better. I'm a natural at this. SpongeBob's gonna love that one. This is the most famous museum in Atlantis. This museum is powered by Hidden College. I better restock on packs. More patties, more patties. Please do not think. I'm out of patty ammo! Long robot fridge bag is in the kitchen shop. More patties! More patties! More patties! More patties! More soup! What a beer I am utterly spent in the patty department. I'll have to wait for the flash to cool, then try again. isn't really my color. We destroyed your most prized possession! You numbskulls! Everyone knows that wasn't the real bubble. It's just a prop for stupid tourists. This is the real deal. Summon the Atlantean Royal Guard! Oh no!
we've popped the Atlanteans' oldest living bubble. Now we're in trouble. All right, here's the plan. Stay here and blubber like a baby! No, that won't work. Escape through the palace! We'll need to use Patrick's strength, Sandy's lasso, Squidward's tentacles, and Mr. Krabs' pockets. I was going to offer my unfeasibly square pants to help, but apparently my spatula skills are more useful. Guide the characters around and use their abilities whenever a prompt appears on the screen. The instructions on how to use each power always appear at the top of the screen. Don't forget, you can switch between characters, too! Just look at this place, Sandy. It'll need both of us to figure a way out. We're gonna have to figure this place out together, SpongeBob. Caught ya! SpongeBob SquarePants and Sandy Cheeks. What a team! No luck here. Come on! Flip! My turn. I'm gonna lasso open some walkways.
anyone here. We never see any action. Gotcha! Turn on the lights. I'll help now. Those tourists obviously didn't come this way. Let's light this place up. Tippy, tippy, tip toes. We're all alone. All right. Flip my plastic. We should check out this area. When duty comes, let's light this place up.
ticket to get over there. this, Patrick, but we're going to have to work together. My turn!
should check out this area. Just me, some science, and a brain cell called Patrick. My turn. Is this a room or an equation? I can smell kelp flavored ice cream. What? Checkaroo! Wow! I feel like I'm inside a brain. Oh, 
should do something. My turn. Mr. Krabs, I don't think we want to upset anyone in here. I'll help now. 
I can't do this alone. <laughs> Mr. Krabs, I just want you to know, it was a privilege to flip your patties. again soon. I hope. I can't wait to be flipping patties again. Now to get those weapons! Ow! 
trapped. Now it's Plankton's turn in the spotlight. Although since he's trying to sneak into Atlantis undetected, he'll be trying to avoid all the spotlights he can. Ah! Plankton has to make his way through three areas to reach the Atlanteans' forgotten mega zappy weapons. Help Plankton make the right actions to avoid the Atlantean security devices and defenses. Don't make the actions too soon or get them wrong, because that will raise the alarm level. And if it gets too high, it's all over. Time to execute a plan that is not only needlessly elaborate, but also unnecessarily convoluted. The technology of this bus is quite peculiar. Maybe I should take a closer look. Ah, sweet, sweet world domination. I knew my plan was a little flat, but this is ridiculous. Come to Papa. You know, world domination makes me happy. Maybe Karen is right. I really should see a therapist. Nah. <laughs> it burns my eye. Yes, being evil is the most fun a single celled invertebrate can have. Come to Papa. I don't believe my plans aren't working. It's nearly time to crush my enemies like the vermin they are. Ouch! Finally out of that cursed exhaust system. Life is good. This place is quieter than a chum bucket during lunch rush. Where is everyone? Perhaps a disguise is in order. What a beautiful day it is for destruction and mayhem. And picnics too. But mostly destruction and mayhem. Unhand me! Don't you know who I am? What a beautiful day it is for destruction and mayhem. And picnics too, but mostly destruction and mayhem. Plan isn't working. Stay calm, Plankton. You've just become my enemy, Anemone. That was a walk in the park. Soon the Atlantean weapons will be mine. Also, <laughs> Ah, 
time for an elaborate and needlessly complicated plan. Excuse me, maniacal genius walking here. Time for an elaborate and needlessly complicated plan. Sounds like they're on to me. I must exercise ex I should have brought my giant chumbot along. Is this going to take long? I have an appointment this afternoon to rule the world! What Karen's up to right now? Probably defragmenting her hair again. <laughs> quiet, stupid alarm. I'm thinking here. Excuse me, maniacal genius walking here. Soon, victory will be within my grasp. This is not how you treat someone with a college education. Are you ready for some rootin' tootin' squirrel-based mayhem? Sandy's taking charge, and she's going to get us out of this palace if she has to zap every single guard in her way. Actually, I think she's loving all the action. Must be a squirrel thing. Anyway, she's using Squidward as a weapon, don't ask, to defeat the guards. So just point and zap. Don't forget to reload whenever you get a chance. A Texan scientist karate chopping squirrel is always ready for action.
bubble. Reduced to weaponry. How insulting. We need to get to the top platform. Time to reload.
Why do all major events end up in an elevator shaft? We need more ping pong. And so that's how we got here. I know, Patrick, I was there.
Here we go! Plankton's got a hold of his Atlantean super mega really really big tank and he's on a rampage! This is where we came into our adventure all those levels ago. So let's find out how it ends. All you've got to do is help Plankton make it to the next area. But the Atlantean defense forces would like to stop him and will need to be bombarded with ice cream. In fact, just blast everything with ice cream. That's pretty much the idea of this level. Don't forget, the tank's shields will recharge if you don't get hit for a few seconds, so running away works. Let the plagiarization of Atlantis begin. Come and throw! 
Into airlock now. This place is weird. Now. I am your worst nightmare.
cold-hearted single cell I am. <laughs>
I should have been a major general. Plankton's bath tastes like ice cream! Yeah. The first 
plankton? Ice cream? It shoots ice cream? Hey, let me out of here! This talking speck will make an excellent replacement for our recently deflated national treasure. So long, and thanks for the tour! Close of this quickly. I might just get promoted if I throw this thing away. What a hero! Atlantis. So fine, so bright, so wet. Great work! Success! Success!
Poseidon's pitchfork! Keep on running! That all you've got? Home of the brave and fishy. I'm sure to get promoted to the Seahorse Brigade now.